Alrighty, folks. Coming at you with a revisit today of a Matteo Guinduzzi card that we already did a review of, but is a live card and has been upgraded to an 88 rated now, which is what the uh, the rumors were that the 86s would get a plus two, so it's pretty nice. Looking at this card in comparison to his 86 card, we can see that they gave him plus three shooting and plus three defending and plus two everywhere else, which I think is great. I think the shooting and defending is where I would have wanted those plus threes. Still three star, four star, medium high and everything. Um, they just gave him the informed boost. Looking at this one, you see I only have one game on this one. I got him for 70k a while back before uh, Immobile scored that penalty. And I sold my other ones and whatnot, but we'll just go through this card again real quick. Take him into some rivals games. The stats, you know, they look better. They're, they're all around better than they previously were. We'll see how that actually translates in game. I'm looking forward to the dribbling feeling better. The dribbling stats actually now look great, even without a boost. May end up changing shadow off of him to get the most out of that. And he has four star skills too, so that'll be interesting. May do more with him now. 79 shooting gets him close to Hullet Gang here too, which is pretty cool. 98 stamina? Jeez. Yeah, the physicals are going to start getting absurd. You know, maybe going into Byron, Lazio could win the second leg or or tie and progress on and get another upgrade here. But I think Byron, even without Upamecano, are probably favored at home by quite a bit. So we'll see how that goes. Didn't give any play styles, but he's already got a nice assortment. Let's get him into some Rivals games here. We, we got his opponent here, Kimmich, the card that unfortunately did not get upgraded during the, uh, the game that they played. But... We'll get into some games here and see how Guendouzi does. Hello to you from Milan, a city synonymous with mm, high fashion. Man's got the, the stadium might not be Miami badge. Okay. Iconic, pretty tame team, to be honest with you. Inform Bellingham's pretty cool. Ooh, good cutout from Guendouzi. I like that. Huge reach. Let's hope he plays well today. Oh my, another great reach from Guendouzi. Shevchenko, man, his long shooting is impeccable. Didn't even power shoot it. Drop it back to Guendouzi here and see how his dribbling feels. Oh, okay. He's actually quite responsive. Wow, he's quite responsive. Oh, I see him open over there. Good chip from Guendouzi. Oh, Guendouzi. Oh, he does not have power shooting. That took, look how long it took him to wind that up. Oh, Guendouzi wins that header, no problem. Guendouzi feels so agile off the ball for someone that has all that height. Look at that. The reach is crazy. Guendouzi. Oh, he's getting closed down on super quick. Four man. Yeah, four man close. I just wanted to see if he'd pull out a miracle. Oh. He does. He somehow pulls the foul there. What in the world? Pretty nice little layoff from Guendouzi. Let's get it back to him. He's got space here. He makes some room with it. Oh, he puts in a he puts in a great shot and draws the foul. He's out of here. He's out of here. <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> Not bad at all from Guendouzi in that first game. Two more possessions won than he lost. 100% pass accuracy. He had really great reach, felt great on the ball. Gotta give him credit. See who we get to play against this time. 
at a great stadium. We're here at the San Siro. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray. Noble. Ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it really is an interesting nice. proposition from the point Ooh, of view of all first owner except for Rashford and Liao. First owner Beckham oh my this dude has a crazy team. Caddy do. Caddy do. Tie it up. Mm. Had to try one there with Old Winduzzi. Winduzzi's positioning has been great too. Look at him, he doesn't expect somebody to be that fast. See, he's now ready for that. Wow. Oh, Guendouzi with the clinical interception. Oh, can't make it lead to an assist, unfortunately. Wow, yeah, Guendouzi's transition speed, jockey speed. He feels much better on the ball than he did before. Look at this. He's able to keep up with the owl. Second man press Guendouzi. <laughs> Gets the interception. Guendouzi getting involved here. Stumbles a little bit. Oh my, what a cutback. Ah. Oh. Send it back over to him. Oh, is that a... What a pass. What a pass, what an assist. Guendouzi is showing out. Hey, there's the high roller. I don't feel so good. <laughs> Oh, okay, that may be Guendouzi's weak foot, or I just aimed that terribly because that was an awful shot. Oh, borderline foul from Guendouzi there, but he keeps it clean. And an incredible tackle from him. What is going on with this Guendouzi card? Again, this Guendouzi card, like, shining even among these bigger players. I had an incredible assist, 100% uh, dribble success rate on 17 dribbles, one tackle, did have one more possession loss than one, but I mean, uh, man did everything we asked of him, I mean, it was incredible. Alrighty, folks, this upgraded Guendouzi card, uh, I've seen all I need to see. I mean, this card truly, uh, something special is going on with this card, I mean, Plus three in the shooting, it at least makes it more usable. Plus three defending is just great. And then two everywhere else is exactly what he needed. This card really plays well. Highly recommend Shadow on him because it gives you the eight interceptions. His interceptions, I mean, uh, crazy good interceptions. With that 95 agility, he can just lunge in front of balls like crazy. Um, I want to see, it. yeah, 89 reactions. He, he felt like more than that man's reaction speed was so quick. Um, truly an impressive card big step up from the previous version the three-star weak foot obviously holds him back i mean especially in a shooting scenario if it's <laughs> if it's on his weak foot which it was on that one shot uh, it's going to be terrible but the passing even on the weak foot passing is good because he's got the play styles so i mean this card's got a lot going for it <sighs> lazio they've got to pull something crazy off of course to take byron out of here but if they do, this card could be absolutely elite, uh, just with one more upgrade, honestly. But the the playstyle would be great. Uh, poor Kimmich. Uh, great card, guys. Uh, truly impressive. Is he worth the 190k extinct price? Let's see if we can compare this one real quick. Um, yeah, extinct. Okay, so he's is he worth the extinct price tag? No, he's not worth the extinct. I mean, that's an insane price for this card he does have good links but i don't know he may be worth that price tag to be fair he performed really well so 
I don't know. Great card here, guys. Let me know if you've used him. Um, thanks for watching, guys. What, what a great card this is.